You've made your choice. Avada Kedavra! You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. I received a flurry of messages from Professor Black's house elf, Scrope. Scrope sent you messages? Yes. I thought it was odd, too. He asked me to meet him and then told me to take the toast. Why would you want to take toast? To a cave under the lake. That's where I found Richard Jackdaw's ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Uh, I think I've lost the book somewhere. The room is called the Map Chamber, by the way. And the portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them, and Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. Rebellion. Travels, my young friends. To think it was beneath us all this time. Not anyone can access it. What if he's the bad guy? Imagine. It's just plain silly, but he's like with Randrock. That is the map. Stars. The map. There's Hogsmeade. Oh. And over here, the Forbidden Forest. And of course, Hogwarts. It's magnificent. No rock, do. If only you were here to see this. Revelio. Hmm. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal, as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend, see now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability, the potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Mm -hmm. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers. 
a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago. Keep in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. Until perhaps now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. Mm -hmm. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces. Traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, wow. in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? Owlery? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. You said that you know that tower. What can you tell me about it? Not much, I'm afraid. I've passed it dozens of times. It's north of Hogsmeade. It's not. My recollection is that it seems abandoned. Clearly, however, the tower conceals more than meets the eye. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful. And do not tell anyone where you're going. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about this Professor Fig. Revelio. He's just like try will try to use us to his own goals at some point, wherever it will be. It's Hogwarts. It's time you learned Glacius, the freezing spell. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Pop balloons over Hogsmeade Station. Pop balloons around the Quidditch pitch. Yeah. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. It does. I'm sure it does. Nothing here. Revelio.
to fox meat. Hopefully we can put down the flames with that one. So I remember there is this one chest in the library we could pick up. Revelio. Fox meat, here I come. Now to Madame Kogawa. Revelio. In her office. Hello. How did you get on with those tasks? I'm done. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Very. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Not with this well, flying model. with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the Glacier. world. There you go. Catching on quickly. Glacius. I think it's learned its lesson. But do continue to practice as long as you like. Kinesthesia is a powerful learning tool. Glacius. Thanks. Looks go pretty handy. It's a fertilizer, I think, is a one time use. Okay. 
Field 5, Field 1. Bogies, we don't have that. Well, we could use those pots that are brewing by ourselves. Sure, another one. What? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This one disappear. the best placement but okay I don't need to change boot here Oh, this other room. Sure, what I put in here, to be honest. Just leave this is for now. to make okay do we have this trial Is there anywhere we can still like see something? Faculty tire. Rail glow. Astronomy. This one. So I want to see go from the top one more time. What are you up to now? Revelio. Does that take me? Oh. I haven't been here. Glacius! Oh. 
in here. Revelio. Pretty sure I was here before. Oh. You one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This plus this plus this equals this. So that's what I thought earlier. Okay. Zero plus one plus three. So zero, one, two, three, which is the whatever it is. Lumos. Three headed dragon or something. Stats. And it's two plus three, five plus Lumos. Four. Which is something. An owl? Hmm. Revelio. Now it made it super easy. Arithmancy classroom. This classroom is where students learn about the magical properties of numbers and numerology. Though a great many opt instead to spend the period counting moon calves whilst nodding off at their desks. Hmm. Back to this. Hmm, there's more. It's always the same then. Zero plus seven. Seven plus one. So you need the unicorn here. Six plus two, three, four, five, eleven. So you need the lizard. ready to learn Arresto Momentum, the slowing charm. It allows you to freeze objects or people in mid-air. Simply complete a few tasks and then come and see me. Okay, be there. And this one didn't show anything, this chest. Dragon again. I feel like this one didn't have anything. Revelio. Wow. It's so easy now. Thirteen plus zero. Just need five. This crap thingy. And then we have five plus six, eleven. Need four, which is a now. See, it is just so empty. Revelio. Where's that lady? Why are they empty? Hmm. Go to Madame Kagawa again. I don't know if we need to do the challenges. Spires? Kingbridge Tower. 
What are the spires? Travel there. Jump on the broom. Do what we need to. Resource indeed. Guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Revelio. And summer here. Revelio. Accio, Wingardium Leviosa. Accio, Wingardium Leviosa. Okay, so he's casting automatically. Good Fringo. Good Fringo works. Revelio. Peruvian instant darkness powder. When thrown in the air, this powder from Peru creates an impenetrable darkness resistant to most light creation spells. The Ashwinders have been using it to steal from surrounding areas without detection. Revelio. Let's finish this job and be done with it. Waste of time. Mm -hmm. These guys are here now. Try and start with that maybe. Revelio. No amount of spoils is worth that much spiders. Petrificus totally. Expelliarm. Leviosa. You're only delaying the inevitable. Incendio! Incendio! You're embarrassing yourself! Exposo! I shrink the warning! Levioso! Incendio! Exposo! for your Revelio, you're going to regret that. Come on, Revelio. Okay, did did notice me here. That's good. Uh -huh. work for him.